Here I'm going to help you make a random seating template and rename the classes so it fits you. You come and you're going to download this link. It is an Excel file, so we're not going to use it inside of Chrome. I'm actually going to download it properly. And you may want to file it where it's supposed to go and then open it. When you open it, you want to enable macros. Macros is how the program actually works. To change the name, let's say we go to this first one here. And I want to change this to ing 10.4. If I go create teams, do not click debug. If you do, some issue will happen. I don't know how to fix it. Just click end. And then you're going to view code yourself. And they're in order A, B, C, D, E, F, G. I click on modules. We go to A. Let's double click on it. And all you change is what's in the quotes. Do not change this or anything else. Just change this so it matches. So I'm going to call this ing 10.4. I don't need to go save or anything. I just go back here and it is now fixed. If you want to delete some students from the class, do not just delete them. Otherwise, you're going to have a blank. Instead, delete the whole row if possible and then it will fix itself. If I just delete the bottom number of students, then you're left with that. If you delete everything, you're left with some names not changing. So you don't want that either. So what you want to do, if you need to, you can copy and paste if let's say you delete Philippa, you can copy and paste these on top and delete this last one properly. And then the, it will work. If you want to copy a larger class into a smaller class, you can just select the names wherever you have them and you can paste them in and automatically resize and it will work fine.